comes to an end at the top um, became a popular sign. That's a lot of times the Washington Monument and other stuff like that. So there's Peter. Now, at one time, um, all four brothers and their mom and dad we just visited were all here. And they were entombed, John Moeller um, and... Who stayed here, Henry? Stayed here? Henry's in Bowman. Uh, no, okay. Jacob's here. So you got Jacob, you got Peter, you got John and Rebecca, who were the mom and dad, and then you at one time you had Jay, John Moeller Studebaker and Clement in that mausoleum crypt, but after, oh, their mausoleum crypt was being vandalized, and so the family had a new mausoleum crypt built at Riverview Cemetery up on Portage, and they took the bodies and reinterred them up there. So that mausoleum crypt is empty. So I'm assuming if you have enough rent money, we'll be happy to rent you some space. It actually has more space than my first apartment. So. Yeah, for me. One more. If it's empty, we can make a Halloween wedding. Yeah. Get married in a mausoleum. That would be really cool. Yeah. Wouldn't it? Uh, shut up. You shut up. Did I have to muggle your ass? Yeah. yeah. Be careful. Okay, he's ours. 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 He's <laughs> he's fine. If he's doing it to your dog yeah. in front of everybody, he's doing it to others, too. Mm -hmm. I thought, I'm like, you know what? Why don't you just get away from him? Mm -hmm. He bites you, I'm not going to bite. He can't bite anybody. He's muzzled. He ain't biting nobody. Oh, you see that? Yeah, I saw him do it. He loves to go around Indiana. Put him down. He'll be fine. Put him down. Yeah. Yeah. Move fast, fast enough. I got him. Yeah. 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 You're getting tangled. You're getting tangled. There you go. Let's go out here in the grass. We're right over here. There you go. Now you got more room. You ain't getting it off. Get up. <laughs> it ain't coming off. Take this again. He needs to be held. He's a bit hot. I know. People throwing stuff at me. I got a muzzle on. You're going to um, knock your head. Mr. Papoon uh, <laughs> sold a lot in, like, kind of like subcontracted his rights to the water rights of the St. Joseph River downtown. It had a had a subcontractor come in and dam the river and dig two races, the West Race and the East Race. So we had this thing about water and water power. And it was great that he did it where he did it because later on, he spent a lot of money trying to make a mill race that ran between the St. Joe River, kind of right around like Reaper Park, clear to the Kankakee Marsh, which used to be just west of Mayflower Road, but is no longer there. So they spent a lot of money to dig a huge mill race that ran through here all the way. Well, they almost got there. Um, Mr. Foucault evidently didn't pay attention in geology class, but you'll notice if you go on the south portion of the bypass, you'll notice a sign that says North-South Continental Divide. Yeah. That means everything south of the bypass flows into the Wabash, which eventually flows into the Ohio and into the Mississippi and down to the Gulf of Mexico. Everything
everything to the right or the north of the bypass, where you're standing right now, flows north into the St. Joe River, which gets dumped out north into Lake Michigan. This much water came through the race. <laughs> the wrong way. So, he spent almost $100,000 of his own money, which was a fortune back then. So they called this Coquillard's Folly um, because of that. So he should have paid attention in geology class. So he had built this nice bridge and everything, but eventually went back. They filled it in when the city of South Bend had a cemetery plotted out around here. They decided to bury um, those veterans honorably discharged in wartime and peacetime if they could not afford to be buried anywhere and they lived in the county they could be buried here so those were all veterans graves up and down both sides here so they don't have even this side filled in yet so they bury them i believe just at cost or sometimes most of the time free for that so the coolers folly pay attention to geology class <laughs> He hates that. Look at him, he's trying to get it off. Is there any chance we can take it off and see how he does? Maybe if you kept your mouth shut, you wouldn't have to wear it. What does the flower mean? Which one? Right there. Yeah, then why did you say which one? Why did you just say, I don't know, it would have been a lot shorter conversation. Yeah, like you're ever going to be as smart as a bad kid. Getting all this on tape. All my commentary is on tape. Please take it off of him. Quiet. All right. Now, this big stone here belongs to the stone of Private Enoch Weiss. Now, Enoch Weiss was in the United States military at a time when the military was trying to put down the Geronimo Apache uprising uh, out in New Mexico, the New Mexico Territory. Um, Mr. Weiss, after being fired upon by uh, the Apaches and several of a couple of his troop members getting shot out in a creek area, Enoch crawled out 
grabbed two of his own men, pulled them back, and also crawled out and brought a couple of Native American uh, Apache that had been shot in the crossfire and dragged them to safety also. Um, he eventually died uh, fighting the Apaches, not that time, but another time, and the United States government awarded him the Medal of Honor, which That's is the highest question. award an enlisted man can receive. Uh, there are three Medal of Honor winners in South Bend City, not City Cemetery, but South Bend 